Hello. Hello. Hey everyone. This isn't life. This is a hell realm. You are in a hell realm. A construct. A construct. People speak about nature. Nature itself isn't natural. This isn't life. This isn't living. Quote from the Matrix. You have to understand most of these people are not ready to be unplugged. And they will fight to protect this system. They're dependent on this system. But it's beyond that. It's beyond what's shown in the Matrix. This place is worse than what they show there. This hell realm sewer matrix is worse. Not all is hopeless though. I'm not sharing this or saying this to make people feel hopeless or fatalistic. My message is empowering. Choose freedom. You have to empower yourself. No waiting for fa false heroes or false saviors that never come. You gotta get beyond that. Most in this realm don't know where they are. They have no idea where they are. It's not just that they're distracted or brainwashed. They'll argue, they'll fight you. You speak the truth. They don't wanna leave. They don't wanna leave here. And I suspect that a lot of them are from this realm. This is a hell realm. Are they all real? What are they? Are some of them illusions? We're in a very dark place, and that's what this image shows. Very dark place. And I do love the ravens and crows. Does that mean that they're of this realm, though? They're very spiritual. So where are they from? Maybe they're from somewhere else. Maybe the beautiful creatures here are from somewhere else. Have you ever considered that? Have you ever thought beyond yourself and beyond two feet in front of your face or your porch, thought about what others are going through and also thought, where are these other good spirits from if they're not from here? What's going on in this realm? This is a hell realm. Why do, you, why do people assume this is life or living? This isn't living. This is torture, suffering, slavery. This is a hell realm. This place is wicked, malevolent. It's vicious, it's ruthless. Excuse me, it's ruthless. It's terrible. And all you have to do is give people a little bit of good and a little bit of joy, a little bit of entertainment, a little bit of laughter, a little bit of beauty. That's all you have to do. And most people are right on board in following along, following television, following the government, following the big religions. This place is a place of fucking nightmares. You can't even, most, most can't even remember their dreams or control their own dreams, much less control their own lives, their own happiness, income, health. Everything's fucked up here. Everything's very dark here. If you really dig a little bit beneath the surface, it's all wrong. It's all inverted. It's all evil. This realm is based on evil, life eating life. We're in a dark place of storms, thunderstorms, lightning, tornadoes, tsunamis, earthquakes, firestorms, blizzards, droughts, floods, on and on and on and on and on. It never ends. Maybe it hasn't hit you yet. Maybe it's hit somebody you know. Does it have to hit you personally to wake you up? Because at that point, it's like, what? you're showing that you don't care about what happens to anyone else. Which is the norm in this realm. By the way, checkerboard floor, nightmares. This is a nightmare realm. This is a very dark place. It's a dark realm. It doesn't matter if you go outside and there's sunshine. That's enough to convince morons that they're not in the hell realm. 
but they are. Here's a fake Jesus at Niagara Falls. Some people try to get on my back over showing Jesus images. I'll show them all the more. Maybe they don't understand. They, they assume that I don't understand. But I do understand. I do understand. I have read the books that were not included in the Bible, including the Gospel of Thomas. I'm aware of the two into one. I'm aware of the kingdom within. I'm aware of all that. I'm also aware that Jesus is taught by Freemasons in their lodges and temples. They have Freemasonic Bibles. Maybe you should look a little deeper. Maybe some of you should look a little deeper into what... Maybe Jesus was a master mason. Maybe some of you should look a little deeper into evil and deceptions and trickery in this realm. Maybe you should look a little deeper. People that come to my channel and assume that I don't know anything. I've been studying these things for decades. Maybe your Jesus is the same as the devil. Good guy, bad guy, good cop, bad cop. One and the same. One and the same, I meant to say. Two into one. There's your two into one right there. Two into one. Janus, two-faced God. Or good and evil in one. There you go. There you go. Dark and light in one. Duality. There you go. You're in a hell realm built on duality. To trick you. That's what it's about. To keep you here. To keep you recycled over and over and over and over again. Just to, just that, to be memory wiped or have your memories not readily accessible, which they aren't to most, and recycled spiritually over and over and over again. Just that, without massive suffering, that in itself is hell. That's hell. It's not good. It's not good because you're not in a good place. You're not in a good holy place. If your God is so good and holy and innocent and caring, why is this place so fucked? If your God is awesome and brilliant, why is this place designed this way? This is a hell realm. So this, is, this is a very dark place of suffering and disease and depression and despair and evil and repetition and slavery and toiling and bodies getting broken, and aging, and decaying. That's what this place truly is. And food growing out of shit, fertilizer, and humanure. Pig shit, cow shit, human shit, sewage, on the crops. That's what everything grows out of here, is shit and piss. You're in a fucked up place, where some minds break. Some lose their minds. Some have nervous breakdowns, mental breakdowns. Many suffer with anxiety, disorders, depression, bipolar disorder, all kinds, all kinds of mental distress and mental disorders and dis-ease. Dis-ease. They're never at ease here. Never at peace. Most people are not happy in this realm. Or they fake happiness. They fake their lives. They fake their way through. They pretend. They're phony. They're false. They're fakes. They're frauds. They're actors, pretenders. They act on YouTube. Most of YouTube is an act. It's staged. It's fake. And a lot of you gobble it up. You love it. You love the shit channels. You're subscribed to dozens or hundreds. You don't get, you don't get notifications for quality because you're loving the shit of this place. This place is full of demons. Doesn't matter if they wear dirty wife beaters or pinstripe suits. It doesn't matter. They can wear Armani suits or Gucci or boss suits or whatever. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. There's a lot of demons in this place. If they look human, it's enough to fool most. Most people don't think deeper or look deeper. The eye in the sky of an evil god watching. A sinister, malevolent presence. An evil. That's what there is here. You're never alone. You never, you never have the feeling of I'm by myself completely in this place. Always a feeling of being watched. Always that feeling of being watched. 
this is the dream time. This is the dream time. Singing lullabies to vampires. Whispering cosmic caresses over the deaf ears of God. Thorns in the eyes of wandering rebels as angels have heavenly battles with banging disguised as thunderstorms. Everything is alive. Shaken spirits under glass in the Thunderdome. This is the dream time. This is the dream time. This is the dream time. Endlessly worried about time, spinning empty seconds on your withering wrist. When beyond this realm, time doesn't exist. Food and sleep aren't needed. True intentions guide the spirit. Intentions manifest desires. Speed of thought travels, naked beauty. The eternal touches me when I see beyond the plasticity of cities, roads, boxes for homes, look-alike acres, and the grid designs etched upon the earth like circuit boards seen from the plain. The eternal speaks to me when I see beyond myself, when I see past the firmament and all of the barriers and governors here placed upon bodies, organs, and minds. When I see time as a construct and space as something beyond the snow globe or thunderdome that we live contained. This is the dream. This is the dream. Look at that tunnel. Tunnel of light. That's, the, that's not the only thing that you have to avoid. That isn't the only thing that you have to avoid, which is what some people try to boil it down to. The gates, two pillars of Freemasonry, B and J, BJ, BJ, Boaz, and Joaquin, Heaven's Gate, you understand? You understand? A woman with a raven. She has raven black hair. Earlier I showed Gandhi with Mother Teresa and Jesus. People think they're holy. People are deceived in this place. They don't have a clue. Most don't have a clue. And they don't want the truth. They don't want the truth. Why do you have so many nightmares? Why are there millions of people having nightmares right now in this realm? Millions. What's the point of that? What's the purpose? What's the purpose of suffering here in this realm? What's the point of sleeping? Going to sleep for six, eight, ten hours, whatever it is. Night after night after night, what's the point? What's the point of that? Ravens again. Maybe you will maybe you will understand one day why I keep showing you ravens. Maybe you'll understand. Maybe you won't. Some of you mock everything, you're quick to laugh and mock. And join in with the crowd. If ten or twelve or twenty on Team Evil or laughing at me or making jokes, you'll join, some will join in. You go right ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. See where it leads you. See where all of this leads you. See where all of the attacks and denial and mockery, joining with Team Evil, see where it leads. See where all of this leads. It leads somewhere. It leads somewhere. Look how evil that looks. It looks evil. Because it is evil. And if you follow evil, you will be treated as evil. You will be judged as evil. If you stand with evil, you deserve to be treated as evil. And you will be. You will be. I promise. I promise. I promise you that evil. Team evil. 